always been a community person, you know, growing up in a small community. I love the way how a community can influence society. And so when the opportunity was presented to me, of course, I agreed to accept so that I can provide a little bit more. What do you do, Tracy? I'm a banker, actually. Okay. <laughs> okay. So this, what does this becoming a JP mean to you right now? Um, I'm very proud. Um, first, to be even considered for the role. It, it is, it's, I believe it's a position that's going to allow me to serve a little bit more, to be able to contribute more, not only to my immediate community, but to the society. Um, it, you know, it helps the younger generation as well, gives them something else to look up to. Um, another person that they can take an example of, of the, the journeys in life really that one should seek to undertake, you know, to become a better person in general. So, I'm very, very honored. I'm Patrick Estwick, Patrick Owen Estwick. Mr. Estwick, what do you do? I am a financial senior at financial advisor at Satch Coral, I think. Okay, so tell us, um, what made you take this decision to become a GP? Well, when they asked me, uh, I immediately remembered how much my beloved Satch Coral uses um, the services of justices of the peace and I think most of them have just retired anyway. Um, then I remember that even as a former immigration officer how important documentation is getting things signed and, and sworn off etc. And I could not say no, um, especially um, um, MP20 Moore uh, requested that I consider it and it didn't take me long, I said yes. So tell us, what does it mean to you now becoming an official, officially becoming a GP? I can I can say this much that um, as much as I am familiar with the signing off on documents etc., the training alone let me know that there's so much more I was completely unaware of. Um, it is very, it's an honor, it's a privilege, and it's a very serious undertaking which I intend to execute with all the training my parents have bestowed upon me and uh, just pouring on the specifics of this particular task um, and I hope I'm making my family proud. My name is Almonda de Pisa and tell me Almonda what do you do? I am a banker. Tell me what made you take the decision to take up this role? It, I find it a privilege to be able to assist other persons in my country because we have all been called to serve and so we are giving more to others. And what does it mean to you now finally becoming a GP? It is an honor to become a Justice of the Peace. It is one that I will serve with the honor that it merits. For most of my um, adult life, I have served in various capacities, namely as football captain of this country. I've represented the sport of football. I've administered in the sport of cricket, being a director of the Barbados Cricket Association. And I had the honor and privilege of being the president, tenth president of the most historic club on the island, Empire Club. And currently my role um, at this time, because of that background, I obviously was recommended by someone who thought that I can assist with regards to being a justice of peace and continue community work. How, what does it mean to you personally now? To me, it adds to the responsibility um, of what I do now. In a kind of private capacity, I'm a member of the Freemasons Association of Barbados. And in that capacity, I also come across um, helping people across the community in terms of charity work, etc., and so this, by my opinion, is an extension to what I've stated before, what I'm doing now, and going forward. Okay, wonderful. Thank you very much.